At the Trip in the Colors ceremony for King Charles III's birthday, we witnessed the Princess of Wales, Catherine, make a remarkable return to public life after a six-month battle with cancer. Joined by her children, she watched the event from a major general's office. Catherine, who continues her preventative chemotherapy, emphasized the importance of patience and self-care during her ongoing treatment. Her presence was met with cheers and she was seen engaging warmly with her family and the public. Observers and commentators have noted her changed appearance, with many speculating that her six months absence could have been for a little nip and tuck on the face. This is Majesty Sussex Report. We'll be talking about this and maybe a little bit more. Welcome. This is Majesty Sussex Report, and I'm Antonio. And, you know, I should make this like after hours instead of like a regular podcast because it is pretty late. And I wasn't planning to actually um, do a, an episode today. I was going to do one tomorrow. But I was just sort of sitting here. I w- was watching some stuff and then wrote some other things. And I, I just thought, why don't I just record this right and and have 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 an episode it's not as of right now it's not midnight yet so here we go i hope you're all doing great i hope you all got up this morning really early um to watch the reappearance of um princess uh catherine and um the 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 debut right debut of her um refreshed and um you know happy look so i when i finished the um episode for after dark because i finished it really like i was like i just redid it it anyways and so i was like okay i'm just gonna go to bed i'm gonna call into bed that set my alarm because I, I I didn't even know what time it was, and um, you know I'll I'll wake up and on time to, to to see what's happening. So as I you know I brush my teeth and stuff, I get into bed, and I was like I hear these birds like chirping outside my window. I was like, oh, why are the birds chirping so loudly? I was like, what the heck? So I opened my my curtains and I was like. Oh, it's sunrise already. I was like, what time is it? So then I saw the time and I was like, oh, mm -mm, I need to turn the television on now because what time is it in in the UK? And when I realized the time it was, I, I, you know. So then as I see the carriage with um, the king and um, his woman, and then I was like, okay, so I guess, you know, 
it's happening, it's happening, it's gonna happen. And there comes the carriage, and I, and I start taking pictures, you know, I'm, like, I'm just like, and I was like, okay, this is great. None of it is gonna come out right. The, the angle that, that she's on doesn't allow for pictures. And the, the camera on the, the, on the, the TV station is, is not zooming in really, really close in order for us to see. So, and even taking the picture comes a kind, kind of blurry. So as soon as I finished that, I was like, okay, so I have a couple of, of photos here. I'll just up, upload it to the community tab and, you know, you folks can decide, you know, what are you, are we going to say that's not Kate or something, right? So I, then I realized, I said, hang on a second. I, I have a smart TV. I can rewind and maybe I can, you know, focus more and see if I can figure out an, an image. So I did that, no success whatsoever, because it was the same thing, quite, quite blurry. And then I thought, I wonder if they've put like a filter thing in the carriage. So when you try to take a picture, it doesn't, it doesn't, you can't, it doesn't come out properly. And I was like, oh, I can't believe they're doing this. Like, why even like say she's, she's going to be here if, if, if you can't really see her. So I, I'm getting all like, I'm not, I wasn't upset, but I was getting like all like, I don't know, indignant or something. Like it matters to me, which it doesn't. And then I, I decided to go on uh, formerly owned as, known as Twitter and see you know, what the general consensus was, what people were chatting about. And as I'm scrolling down, I see these like, you know, the, 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 the daily failure uh, newspaper or online, whatever. I saw these pictures and I went, wow, they finally were able to buy proper cameras that are able to take pictures and zoom in and you can see the person really, really clearly. Because the cameras that they had like a couple months ago, like the ones that took, you know, Kate and her mom, and Kate in the supermarket or the boat work, boat walk or wherever she was, or the out, I don't know, the organic market, wherever. Um, and then there was another one. Yeah, yeah, the picture with, with, with Kate and William going somewhere. So, you know, I was worried. I was like, I feel bad for them. They can't even afford like professional cameras. But somehow they did today. They were able to afford, I mean, the pictures were fantastic. So I'm looking at the pictures now and I was like, okay, let me just like get, get this on the community so, you know, the people can see it. So I did that. And once I finished doing that, then I sat down and I, I'm looking at, you know, looking at these, these pictures now. And I'm looking at them and I was like, is this her? And then I thought, yeah, it looks like her. And even if it isn't, well, you know, close enough. Like, because, uh, listen, folks, honestly, I haven't lost sleep over any of this, right? And I'm a person who worries about everything. And this is one thing I was not worried about. The only reason or the only thing that worried me a little bit was if they had come out with something like, you know, where she would not be able to show herself anymore because then it would be, well, that institution is literally getting away with, you know what? And, you know, the whole silencing of, of, of women and all that, that would bother the crap out of me. So then that's where I would start to get all crazy so either way like today i was like okay whatever she shows she shows she doesn't whatever i so i'm looking at at these at these pictures and i thought that goes she looks good i said like she looks rested and her face looks like i said i like that i like the, the makeup looks nice it's it's and the smile i said yeah, but the smile looks a little bit weird. I said, I don't recall her being this smiley. She's very smiley. 
like from ear to ear. And I was like, mm, oh, it's okay. It's not. The she looks good though. She looks good. And then it hits me, right? Like it literally, it hits me. I went, did she have a facelift or something? <laughs> and I'm like, no. Like they wouldn't do that. They wouldn't like create this whole like manufacture story and all these other things just so that she can go get a, a tuck, a pullback or whatever you want to call it. And I, I'm like, really? So then I thought, I was like, you know what? Even if it was, or it, it, it isn't, do I care? Nah, I don't care. I really don't. Because it doesn't completely affect me. But it does affect other things. Because if all of this is just a big charade, I'm, I'm, I'm using that word a lot lately, charade, charade. It's, it goes to say something about their mentality. Even not, even, I'll go even beyond mentality, their, their mental health. And what they deem necessary in order to keep a certain facade. Because when I, when I think about the, entire, the entirety of all of this nonsense, not only the Kate thing, but, you know, Megan and um, Harry not, them not accepting the, the half in, half out, you know, William producing this document and which 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 has also Harry's signature on it saying that you know and, and Harry never signed anything, never agreed to anything. Even the way this old relationship with the with the media and the collusion um allegedly and the and the corruption allegedly and, and the sharing and, and, and throwing people under the bus. Like this is your family. Right? And fine, you, you folks want to have a dysfunctional family, maybe you feel comfortable like that, fine. But all of this could be so much better for all of you. You can live a healthy life. Um, you can still have the public adore you. You can still be called a king. You can still have people curtsy to you. You can still have people bow to you. You can still be a pain in the you know what. You know, and have people like put exactly the certain amount of toothpaste on your toothbrush at a certain time, at a certain hour, and it has to be at a certain temperature. You can still do all those things that, you know, people with tons of money do. You can still do all of that. But all this other stuff, you can get rid of it. Because, listen, being the king... I know you don't wield the same power as, I don't know, Henry VIII or something, but you're the king, you're the monarch. You, you're the future king, you're the heir. You can be such a transformative agent for that institution, but you folks seem like you don't even know how to put water into a pot and boil it honestly like i'm i i i i i'm getting that impression that you literally do not know how to put water into a pot and boil the water because you take these really simple things not complicated, not controversial, and you make them into this labyrinth of, 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 of just vomit, basically. Such nonsense. Now, I am still of the belief, right? And this is just me. I'm not asking anyone to believe any of my stuff. I wasn't there, didn't see anything. It's just a feeling, okay? Just a feeling. The same way how, as I said on After Hours, the, ro the, 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 <laughs> the rodents and, 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 and the experts and, and the specialists and, and the insiders 
and the Schofield person, all, all the rest of them, they get a feeling. They get a feeling. I get a feeling also, okay? So my feeling is also as valid as their feeling. And my feeling is, at the beginning, there was something, something there. I don't think it was just about, listen, I, I Kingston, all right? Shotgun can attend my godfather's memorial thing. They say without me, without anyone asking, it has nothing to do with the the Kingston guy being found no longer in existence. Nothing at all. Nothing here to see. Nothing here to watch. Right. So there's something, something there that, that I don't, that we'll, we'll probably never find out, right? But I, and, and I wonder if due to what happened there, that whole emergency thing happened and it, she, you know, and best way to kind of, you know, she had to get, 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 get her face pulled back a little bit, right? Maybe perhaps allegedly, I don't know. I was talking to my, um, one, one of my friends who used to work um, in the magazine industry. And, you know, she, she would tell me things. <laughs> well, she, she, she interned, and then she actually ended up getting, getting a job there. But when she was intern, an intern, like, she's all this stuff. Like, she had, like, some of the, I won't say juicy-ish, but it was good. Like the pe people who work in those magazines, like the fashion magazines and the, where you see, you know, celebrities on the, on, on La Portada in, on the front page or the cover or whatever. Like she said, like you would know, like, you know, certain celebrity or certain whatever would be showing up. And the, the, the person in charge of that segment or that, that, that shoot or whatever. Would be like, okay, so so and so is coming because they will debrief the team. So and so is coming, blah, blah, blah. When so and so goes to the bathroom, don't bother this person. They will be going to the bathroom every 10 minutes or 15 minutes or so. And, you know, just let them. But, well, you know what? Why they go into the bathroom every 10 minutes or 15 minutes, right? <laughs> did you get it? Did you get it? Okay, I hope you did. I hope you did. So that. And there was also someone else that, um, <laughs> oh, I, I'm so tempted to say who, who, who it is, but I, I don't want to get this channel into trouble and I do not need to get into trouble either. So certain person who I actually liked, I was really disappointed when, that, when I heard this, said to them when they were taking, I don't know, they're doing like a sh photo shoot or whatever, at, at the headquarters of the magazine said to them, so the assistant actually said to, I guess the, the, the lesser people, so my friend was one of them, said, so-and-so will not be speaking to any of you, so don't look at her, don't speak to her. If there's anything you need her to do or something, please come and speak to me. And please do not look at her. Thank you. And I said, I said to my friend, I said, really? I'm like, but I like her. She's like, you know, she's like a representative. And she's like, she's doing great. And she's like, oh, man. You know, that disappointment. But I'll tell you someone who they said was really fun. Like, like my friend, when she was in. She goes, she goes, she was so much fun. It's, uh, it's, it's one of the, I would say, the legends of, of, of music. Um, and I'll say um, she sings, uh, is it Over the Rainbow? Yes, Over the Rainbow. And she kicks her shoes off or whatever. So people who know, you know. I was so excited and so happy when, when my friend was like, she is like just beyond fabulous. Like she talks to everyone. She'll actually sit down and talk to you. And she goes, she's just, she's just like 
golden, 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 right? And I just, I was just so happy to hear that because I love her too. I love, I love that woman. Um, I'm getting side sidetrack. What were we talking about again? Yes, we're talking about um, <sighs> the opening ceremonies of the colors of the tropin. Um, listen, if they if they've had to go through all of that. All the manipulation, all the lies, all the like photoshopping, all the AI um, creation. It, it, it's so simple. And maybe I, I'm the one who's being naive, right? But can you just imagine if, if they just like, just, just come on and say, just, you know, it's, so much that I think we can avoid with issues and problems. And it has to do with honesty and communication and being straight, straightforward. Fine. You're the future queen. Fantastic. Right? You, you, you're, you're feeling a little, I don't know, you're, you're actually 41, but you feel like you're 89. Okay? And you look like you're 99. And you just want to like, you know, at least look, look your age. Right? Because you've had it tough the last couple of years. I don't know doing what, but you've had it tough. And, oh yeah, I remember now what I was going to tell you folks. So there was, the, my friend was telling me, there was a rumor about, you know who? The, 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 the new face person. Um, about, you know how quickly she would um she would be pregnant and then she would like pew, pew, right like within a couple of weeks boom, boom, like super because that's the other thing i wanted to talk about like is it just me is is it is it is it my my monitor what is it like she has gotten like super skinny like i know when it comes to people's weight and their health and so on like i try to stay away from it because who knows Right, and I don't know. I'm just saying that there was a rumor way back when, right? At least in that industry, like the magazine industry, about how she always is that that thin. And watching her today with that outfit also that reminded me of my fair lady. I think, was it Audrey Hepron? No, no, no. Audrey Hepron is the, is it Hepron? Audrey, uh, he, I, I'm not even pronouncing her name correctly. She's the one that, that has the, when she was older, she was the one who lived in Maine. And uh, um, breakfast at, Tiff at Tiffany, she lived, was it in Sweden? Okay. I don't know why I'm thinking about this, but that's the that's the 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 actress Audrey. I think she did something Rome Roman holiday also. Okay, so I know these random things, but I can't like get get her name. <sighs> okay, so her outfit reminded me of that movie, and. I think this is the second time like she's done outfits, well maybe more more than more than second time. Um that she's had outfits um where it was sort of like very costumey, very movie like or from a movie. So I mean she looks good. I'm not saying she doesn't, but she's she's super thin, like like thin thin. Um well I shouldn't talk. I'm not thin, thin. I, 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 maybe, maybe I should, I should, I should, I should give her a ring, you know, bring her up or send her a letter or something and say, "Do you want some of my like extra, you know? Because I've, I've got some to spare, and I can, I'll volunteer it." <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Okay, so that is that. What do you folks think? Right? Do you think like it? It is indeed like she got a little pullback, you know, in the in the face. So now she looks all refreshed. 
Um, or do you just think it's like really good makeup, right? Because and good lighting and whatever. But here's the other thing too, that of that whole observing and watching and stuff. So Louis, Prince Louis, or Louis, was 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 be, being himself and is fantastic. And I I don't let me let me stick with one one theme at design. So she was very um I don't know, uncharacteristically smiley and looking super happy and very touchy with the kids. And the only one seemed to be like, I don't know, being himself was Louis. But Prince George and Princess Charlotte, they, they looked a little bit sort of like, I don't know, the vibe I got was, who are you? Like, like literally, I'm, I was watching them and watching them and I said, and I was like, the two older kids are not, like, they're not buying this. And I'm like, well, it is Kate, or it looks like Kate. I'm like, they, they, like if, that, that is Kate, right? And I'm going, well, why are the two kids, the older ones who, who can, you know, they understand what's going down. They don't seem very, they're being very polite, as they should or they usually do in public. But I've seen them before a little bit more casually, like like when they, they're next to their mom or their dad or whatever. They just seem very distant from, from this person and almost like, who are you? You look like our mother, but you're not. So this goes back to my whole thing about something happened. And that's the feeling I get. Something happened. It, this wasn't just about her getting a... a, a a refresher to her face, right? I think something happened, allegedly. I don't have any proof. I just have a feeling, all right? Just a feeling. And the other thing, too, it was about, like, how she was smiling and, and, and I don't know, joking with King Charles. It's not something, like, we see... Generally, it's almost like I kept thinking at one point also, I was like, is she on medication? Right? Nothing wrong with that. But I was like, hmm. So all these thoughts were kind of going through my, 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 my mind. But listen, I, I, I'm happy that the Kate that we see looks, looks, looks okay. I mean, it, it, of course, brings up a lot of questions like if, if you've been taking a chemo, you look pretty darn good for someone who's been doing, doing chemo. And at the same time, different bodies react different, differently to, to chemo, right? But with her frame, and she's been like, come on. I, I don't know. I'm just telling you. This is all still very weird, and <laughs> it must be nice, though, if, if there's one thing, it must be nice to have an entire an, government, institution, um, security, secret service, all of these important pillars of our society to have them at your disposal, right? To be able to just say, okay, well, this thing happened, so can you folks just go fix it? Because like, that's how I feel. I feel like something happened, right? They came up with a storyline to go, to go by, and they, they decided that the best would be, let's just, let's just declare cancer. Let's say the king has cancer, and you have cancer, and you get cancer, and everybody gets cancer. That's my bad Oprah imitation, and I'm not making fun of cancer once again, people. Like, you know, I'm just speaking here, trying to get some coherent thought out of me. 
And I hope I don't have to say again, like I had cancer in my family. My, my mom, you know, has had cancer. So, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What to do? What to do? It is just also, where do we go from here, folks? Huh? The other thing, too, I know some, because I was you know, listening to some chats and stuff. So some squaddies feel like they were duped or like, you know, they, they, were, they were taken for a ride. Listen, listen, folks, listen. You ready? Listen, Linda. Linda, Linda, listen. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. We weren't taken for any ride. Okay? We only get on rides we want to get on to. Okay, let's 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 switch that that mentality and let's switch that thought. We get on the rides we want to get on to. We were doing a public service as good people, good citizens, right? Unlike the people that support or say they support, you know, the Princess of Wales, we don't do the things they do. We are analytical. We're intelligent people. Well, I, you know, me, most of the times I am. Other times I'm like just a silly person. We're intelligent people. We are people who care about the environment. We care about the people around us. We care about charities. We are empathetic. We care about how institutions ab abuse their power. We care. So we weren't taken for a ride. We weren't like conned or anything. No, no, no. We did our... De uh, our, our citizen um, diligent obligation, and I'm inventing this now, right? We just we just did what was right because we don't we don't trust that institution. And it doesn't matter, you know. She's the mean girl on her pathway to redemption or not. I don't know. We are people that will still, you know, want to make sure she's, that she's okay. Because, you know, we know what an institution is capable of. Right? And I, I always have this, you know, as much as I may not agree with someone or I, I'm not, you know, I have a falling out with that person. I don't wish anyone ill, number one. You know, what's happened has happened. Fate, destiny, God, the universe will take care of whatever it needs to take care of. That's just the way I think. And I will still wish you well and I'll walk. But, and, and if I see you and, you know, something is not going well, I'm not going to turn my back. I mean, I'm not going to, like, go out of my way to, like, I will help. I will say, okay, hey, 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 let me, let me help you with that. Are you okay? You fine? Awesome. Bye bye. Right? I don't need to get over involved in why or this or that, but it doesn't mean I need to lose my humanity. So, for anyone feeling a little bit sort of like taking advantage of or anything, we were not taken advantage of. Mm -mm. No, no, we were not. We came into this as concerned citizens knowing what an institution that has done certain things in the past is capable of doing again. As much as we don't agree with anything that person has done, we know the repercussions of putting a blind eye to whether it's spousal abuse or an institution doing things that they shouldn't be doing, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And I'm not saying any of that happened to this person. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. And I don't know why lately I've been doing that a lot. I think I have this sort of like... <laughs> Let me tell you why I think I've, I've been do doing that a lot lately. So for some reason also, I, in my feed for YouTube, in the last couple of days, I've been getting like these videos of people who've had their accounts either canceled, 
with YouTube or 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 find or whatever it is that it or oh, suspended. So I'm in this like I was like, how many people did it suspend? Like, right? And it's like every day I get a couple on my feed, and and maybe in me because I want to hear the story. I was like, click on it. <laughs> so that's why I'm getting more of that. You oh dingo head. That's why. Because I'm clicking and I'm watching and I'm telling the algorithm that this is what I... Man. Sometimes I swear. <laughs> so, <laughs> sometimes I swear. Like, I was like... My mom, my mom has the best thing. She, she, she... <laughs> She used to say it to me sometimes, because sometimes things, something will happen, and I get like this blank look in my face. I was like, uh, I don't know. So my mom had this thing about me. She would say to me, she goes, academically, you are so intelligent. You're so, you're, you, you're just brilliant. She goes, but common sense, like sometimes it takes you a while. <laughs> I'm like, mom, that's not a good that's not a compliment. She goes, I didn't mean it as a compliment. <laughs> so sometimes the obvious, it takes me, uh, I don't know, a second. I was at a play. I was watching a play. Or was it a play we were watching? I don't remember. And um, a, a line from uh, one of the, the, the actors, you know, one of the, one of the characters, goes, my name, um, oh, shoot, I want to say it, but I don't want to get, so you know there is there is master and 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 mister. So this person prefers to be called master, and the person's last name was the same last name of um, that actress that was in that movie where she was a writer and she had this guy tied up on her bed and he couldn't move or whatever her last name. So put the two things together. Anyways, if you just did it, um, and if you know what movie I'm talking about, Misery, I think it was called. Uh, so we watched this thing. Was it, I think it was a third, no, we watched it on a Friday uh, because it was an evening show. So we watched it on a Friday. And Monday, because you know people are laughing and this and that, and I was like, you know, that the joke went right over my head. Monday, I'm at school. I'm walking through the cafeteria, heading to where some of my friends were, were seated. And in the middle of the cafeteria, I scream out the entire thing. Like the entire ma master and the other thing, right? I, I say it like really loud because it just hit me. I went, oh my God, that is so funny master and i was like and everyone just turned to like what the heck is wrong with antonio and i'm like guys it's like like i just got the joke they got the joke like on friday i got it on monday yeah now now you know too much about me so i have to like i have to press the button and <laughs> look into the screen and I'm gonna flash the pen or something, and you're gonna forget everything I said. Oh well, what 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 else is there to talk about? I don't think. I mean, I don't know the whole thing with them on the balcony and oh. <laughs> now, okay, so some of them were in, in the carrot in the carriage thing, and then the other ones were in that like. What does it call? A, 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 no, it's not aquarium. It's a, da, 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 that instrument. It's a, 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 I'm having really some issues today getting words. I can see the image of, 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 the, of the thing, and my brain is not connecting to what it's called. I think I need to sleep. <laughs> Um, accordion, accordion, that accordion. So that's the name of the instrument. Anyways, the Lady Louise, Louise or Louisa, or whatever, and um, you know, Edward's wife and and 
But Edward wasn't there, though. I didn't see him. So I saw his wife, uh, Ford Fiesta. Is it Ford Fiesta we call her? I think. Um, so did they, were they trying to hide her? Or was she trying to hide herself? I don't know, because it was just ridiculous to, like, the entire thing, and I think it was drizzling or something. I'm not sure. But the entire, you know, they had the, the, the cover up so you could you can see her, right? Because her and this other man was, and I was like, okay. I was like, I did try to hide you, and then I realized, oh, it's drizzling or whatever. It might, it might rain. So that was the reason why. But I just thought it was funny because at the beginning, I just started laughing. I was like, man, you can't even like, you're trying your best and they're still, they're still treating you folks like this. <laughs> but anyways, I think, I think that's it for now. I'm, all, I, all I talked about was, you know, her returning. Let's see what happens now. I mean, 